Namaste and welcome to another episode of Perch Talks. I'm Eileen Stromberger, the reference librarian at the Fairchild Air Force Base Library. And as you may have guessed, today I'm going to talk about fitness and exercise that you can do during the stay at home order during the quarantine. Now, if you have an exercise routine already, that's wonderful and stick with what you're doing. But if you're not, here are some ideas that you can do to get you going. Of course, before you do any kind of exercise, it's a good idea to check with your doctor to make sure that you are able to do any kind of exercise. But I know it's really easy when we're staying at home to sit in front of the TV and just keep snacking and binge watching different TV shows or movies. But we do need to move around a little bit and get outside. Uh, those are still things we can do at this time. So some ideas that you can do, um, of course, as you see, uh, yoga is one of the things that I enjoy doing inside the home and I don't have to worry about uh, keeping six feet away from other people or social distancing. But you can do other things at home as well. You can actually just put on some music and dance like nobody's watching because chances are nobody is watching except maybe the people that you live with or your pets. So that's one idea. Uh, other things that you can do is you can do aerobics at home. I don't know if anybody remembers that from uh, the 80s, but there are a lot of retro exercises that you can do if you go to YouTube. Uh, probably it's a popular website with a lot of people. Uh, if you go to YouTube, uh, you can just put in aerobics, you can put in whatever kind of exercise you're looking to do. I highly recommend going there for watching some fitness videos that you can exercise along to. Uh, some really interesting and fun things that I found on YouTube. I don't know if anybody remembers Richard Simmons and the sweating to the oldies, but you can find his videos on YouTube and he plays some great retro 50s music and other kinds of music and you can just bop along and uh, get some movement uh, with those videos. Uh, some things that you can do outside uh, during the stay at home order, you can walk around your neighborhood, you can, uh, you can ride your bike, you can go rollerblading, you can skateboard. Just keep in mind if you do those things outside in your neighborhood, make sure you're doing it either by yourself, you're doing it with other members of your household and if you do see other people outside make sure that you are keeping at least six feet apart from them uh, another good idea is if you are on one side of the street walking or riding your bike or what have you and you see somebody coming towards you it's actually not impolite these days to just go over to the other side of the street. So to make sure you have that healthy distance between you and the other person, because uh, we definitely don't want to get sick. We want to keep ourselves healthy. We want to keep other people healthy. And if you are interested in any fitness magazines, RB Digital is a very good place to go to for that. You, there are a lot of fitness magazines there. You can also get different books on fitness in RB Digital. Uh, other places for books that you can go to, you can go to Overdrive, you can go to Hoopla uh, for any books and information on fitness and exercising. Another website, or I should say database, that's good to go to, which I haven't mentioned before, is called Universal Class. And this is free of charge, like all of our other databases at the library. Universal Class is a website or a database where you can actually take a class with instructors. Um, there are some quizzes, some tests, but there are some classes for fitness if you need to have a little more motivation and you want to do it with somebody teaching you virtually how to do different things. Uh, I found a yoga 101 class on Universal Class. There's also a weightlifting class. There are some other 
health and fitness classes that you can take. So uh, just contact the library for information on that. Either uh, call us at 509-247-5556. You can also message us through Facebook. And of course, there is our email, fafblibrary at gmail.com. And just as a little footnote, a universal class has more than just fitness classes. It also has classes on homeschooling, teaching resources, maybe some things that would be useful to quite a few of you right now with kids uh, not going to school at the moment. Uh, there are also a lot of great cooking websites where you can learn uh, how to cook different national, national cuisines. So uh, do go to Universal Class take a look at the different classes that they do offer. Uh, I've done a few of them myself. They're a lot of fun and it's for your own enjoyment and personal enrichment. So until the next time, stay healthy, stay safe, and cheers.